I was just shocked when I found out that Stephen was in the car with Macy when she died. He was the one drunk driving, while Macy gave him oral sex when he totaled her car and killed her. He walked away from her body without telling anyone he was the driver because he didn't want to disrupt his life and future. But the fact that Stephen was Macy's secret boyfriend just killed me? I didn't expect it. Nevertheless, in the seventh episode called Castle on a Cloud, Stephen and Lucy will be happy for a while, but it will change, because you just can't do without shocks. Things soon get complicated with their clashing personalities and a mountain of secrets between them, from other love interests to a tragic death on campus. Lucy realizes that Stephen is no good for her, yet she just can't seem to break the addictive cycle of running back to him. He lied to her, and she played along, fearing that he would leave her. Somehow, the toxicity made Lucy want it all the more. Even though it was hurting her, she did not wish to do away with the emotional turmoil that she experienced with Stephen. This cat and mouse game will continue for a while, but as a result I hope that Lucy will be able to pull herself together and end this relationship. I became very angry with Stephen when I found out about him and Macy. Don't miss the next episode on October 5th.